If you're experiencing abnormalities or protos just seems to be acting up with no explanation, you may want to try trashing your protos preferences. Now there are two items we need to trash, the DAE prefs folder and a DigiDesign folder. I'm going to show you how to do both. To trash the preferences, go to the start menu and click to open your computer. You want to drill down into your C drive, into program files, common files, DD Design, and finally into the DAE folder. The DAE prefs folder is the one you want to delete. Just right click the folder and choose delete. You'll get a warning message about moving it to the recycle bin. Just hit yes and close the window. Now we need to locate one other folder so we can delete that. Again, open your computer and double click the C drive, but this time we're going into the users folder and then into your main account folder. Now in here is a hidden folder called app data. To access it, we need to make it visible. Go to the organize menu and choose folder and search options. Click the view tab and under hidden files and folders, check the option to show hidden files, folders and drives. Then hit OK. Now you'll see the app data folder. Go inside of it, then into the roaming folder. Take the DigiDesign folder and trash it. Just right click and choose delete. Again, say yes to the warning and then close the window. With all the preference files trashed, we now need to launch Pro Tools so that it can write a fresh set of preference files. When you launch Pro Tools, it will take longer than normal to load as it has to check all of the plugins. Once it's loaded, just exit the application and Pro Tools will write a new set of default preferences to your hard drive. And that's it. Just relaunch Pro Tools and continue working on your sessions as normal.